said I didn't want it to fail, goddammit. Don't you get it? Well, for about 40 years, Monsanto has known that its product Roundup can cause cancer. Mr. Hardiman used it for 25 years and he contracted a type of cancer called non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. This lawsuit seeks damages for his cancer. Because it's the first federal case, it really is a, a bellwether for the federal litigation, which has about a thousand cases in it. And so seeing how this case proceeds will be really important for both sides to see how the merits of this case unfold. Now obviously in federal court, there's a lot of things going on here that make it much more difficult for the plaintiffs to succeed. But if we are able to succeed here, then it really sends a signal to Monsanto and specifically to Bayer that they have a real problem. When I took Monsanto's deposition, I took their corporate representative deposition, he said to me that there's no evidence across the board that there's any association with cancer. That's just nonsense. There is a mountain of evidence. And this company needs to get straight and to be honest with its, with its customers and say, listen, there is evidence that it's associated with cancer and get, let people make a choice about whether or not they use the product. This case is about failure to warn. And the simple fact is they haven't worn and they're going to keep being sued until they do.